So I'm sat next to Jamie Chalmers in his Mazda MX-5 that you've just finished competing in for the day. Yes, I have. How's the day gone? Oh, quite good, actually. I was very happy with it. Um, started around a 70 and then just managed to get into the uh, 69, 60. So three tenths away from my PB, but I'm very, very happy over the course of the day, to be honest. Excellent. Uh, that's really good to hear. Now, like me, you were pretty much born in a hill climb paddock. So tell yeah. us, tell us how you got into hill climbing. You've got a big family heritage. Yes, yes. So my granddad used to do it. Um, that was back in the seventies, eighties, nineties, that sort of thing. And then uh, obviously now my father does it as well. So I'm following in his footsteps and my granddad's footsteps and being brought up into it and started competing myself now. So it must be lovely to do a sport that your dad did, that your granddad did. Oh it's really yeah, cool. it's it's fantastic. Yeah, really enjoying it. Really going through and understanding what they've learned as well and learning to apply that myself while also having a good time really that's what it is now whilst you've got a lot of good advisors around you you must have learned so much in your first full year of competing how much have you have you been learning about oh, competing there's so much you've got to learn there's uh, you've got to learn all the rules you've got to learn where the tracks go actually that, that does help i've heard yes <laughs> um you've got to learn when you need to be ready how to get your car ready, everything like that. So there is a lot that goes on, but realistically, you can all learn it within that first couple of events. That really, that's it. That's This is what I need to do, and this is how I need to prepare. And what is your top tip for somebody who may be thinking this time next year, they will they want to be halfway through their first full season of hill climbing. What's your top tip for Oh, them? top tip. What would I suggest? I would think, make sure you know when you need to go so you always get ready on time you know oh, it takes me about this long to get this which obviously you're only going to get through experience so just get out there really start getting into it learn the rules understand what you need to do and kind of go from there just really knuckle down love it that's the main thing actually it's and, love it and what do you love about it oh it's when you see the time at the end of the day and if it has gone right it's like yes fantastic or if something's not quite right then it's a oh well next time I know I've got this quarter to improve and then you're looking forward to the next one after that or next event after that and it's just a it just goes on and on and on yeah and is this your road car yes this is my daily drive I drive it to work every single day and also hill climb so there is a little bit of pressure about keeping it on the black stuff but <laughs> I'm not too worried about that no. just really get it out there and just drive it well Jamie, thanks ever so much for talking to us. Another good day for you, another, yeah, another learning day. Yes, as always. And uh, quicker again when, when you're back here next month, I'm sure. Yes, I will be, yeah. Should be here next month and should, hopefully the weather stays good and just as nice. Fantastic. Cheers, Jamie, thanks a Cheers, lot. Cheers, thanks very much.